Brian had a bite mark on his arm and picture taken near where his remains were found, sleuths say. Brian Laundrie was pictured with what appears to be a bite mark on his right arm and a photo taken near where authorities found his body just one year later. The fugitive Florida at the center of many sleuth theories regarding his fiancée Gabby Petito's death was found in the Carlton Reserve mere miles from his Northport home in a place he was known to frequent it often, now, amateur investigators are looking back at a photo laundry posted to his Instagram as providing maybe even more clues regarding who he was. Does anyone else think this looks like a bite mark on his arm, a person asked on a Gabby Petito Facebook group. Attached to the post was a photo of Laundry at the Carlton Reserve with his nephew sitting on a swing. Laundry's right arm is wrapped around his nephew and on his elbow, there appears to be a bruise reminiscent of a bite mark. That has caught the attention of some perceptive sleuths, but many are prefacing the coincidence is nothing more than that until further proof is found. Maybe she attack and sick him in July and she bit him then, we will never know, wrote the poster. Laundry was found to have died in a swampy area of the Carlton Reserve near his Florida home and a newly unearthed photo from Laundry's Instagram shows he knew the area well and had visited before. Me and the coolest kid I know, my nephew. BFF, S since the day he was born, reads a photo caption Laundry posted to his Instagram on July 6, 2020. People began commenting on the strange location for the photo and where authorities would later find his body in October after a more than month-long manhunt for the only named suspect in Petito's death. Users have commented on the photo expressing dismay at the poor location. RIP. No wonder you picked this spot, wrote one user. Crazy to think that where this pic was taken is not afar from where they found his remains. Another wrote.